Hello YouTube, this is Miss Grizzly again. I believe this game, this HD remake, just came out today. Let me just make sure. It's not going to tell me, but I believe this just came out. I know this came, this came out earlier in the year for Switch. I think this just came out for Xbox recently. Um, I don't know what time it came out, but uh, I played this a bunch when I was a child. I beat the first one. I remember the first one, the boss fight being ridiculous. We're going to do a playthrough of this, a full playthrough, collecting everything and getting every achievement. So welcome to part one. We're going to record this in sections. I don't know if the music is fine or if I might have to do no music, so we'll find out after uploading the first part. Let's go extras real quick. Sound, subtitles on. We'll figure out controls. Okay. There is Parker Moe's challenge. You have only one life. If there is a, if there's achievement for Harker mode, we probably won't do it, um, just because I'm not that into stuff like that. But let's jump right into this. This is tied to tied. It's Manny and Tiger HD. Yeah, if you guys are have never seen this before, this was incredible when it came out. I remember playing this on Xbox a bunch. Could I tell you what the what happens in the story? No way. It's been years. I just. Uh, I got ya! I got ya! <laughs> okay, Ty, I'm in. Catch me if you can. If I remember correctly, the final boss is you have to do a boomerang through a tunnel, and it took me hours upon hours to do. But it probably won't be that hard. Don't be afraid, Ty. I am Nandu Gili, the Bunyip Elder. Can I, mate? It's time you knew the truth. Here, let me. Years ago, a great battle was fought. Let me over remove the fate this stuff for you guys. Mystic talismans. My dinosaur ancestors were here first, you stinking furry mammal opportunists. That, I believe, is the final boss. Remember the comet! No! You mammals don't deserve to be at the top of the food chain! If I remember correctly, you have to no! control a boomerang. And you have to control it and go through the entire mech to the destruction switch. But the rest of the game I can remember little bits of.
Yeah, he needed all the things, but I can't remember why. Those brave few who challenged Boss Cass were trapped in the dreaming. Mom? Dad? Word grows that Boss Cass is seeking out the talismans again. He must be stopped at all costs. It's up to you to find the talismans before he does. It's up to me to save yes. my family. Boy, Ty! Are you okay? Murray? Oh, am I glad to see you. Oh, you're never gonna believe what just happened. I was playing in the forest when the ground suddenly... That's when you showed up. Root! Sounds like you've got a fair dinkum adventure ahead of you, mate. Not that I'm into that sort of thing. I'd much rather be at home watching the footy. But I tell you what, you do the adventuring and I'll help you out where I can. That's fine by me. Okay, let's see if it's time to put back on this. Welcome to Rainbow Cliffs, mate. By the way, whenever you see one of these signs, I won't be far away. I know away. that. I've heard that if you press the action button, you can talk to me, whatever that means. <laughs> okay, now let's get down to brass tacks. If you're going to be out adventuring, then you'll need another boomerang. And I know just the place to find one. Get another boomerang as uh, 100%. Head down to Bly Bly Station. I'll meet you there. Miss this old game. Oh, you little ripper, Ty! You found a fair dinkum rainbow scale. When you find enough, take them to the Bunyip Elder at Rainbow Cliffs. What will it do for me? Yeah, I'm not surprised there. So we do have a live system, which I kind of remember. Controls are a little wonky, but that's fine. I can get used to them. It's just going to take a little bit. That's usually how games go. Um, we should go for the second boomerang anyways, before we really explore this area. There probably is a double jump feature or something like that. Julius. Now, if I just reroute these wires to... I said good day, mate. I is deaf. Oh, goodness gracious me. Oh, I didn't see you there. <laughs> didn't hear us either. I was just making some last-minute adjustments. Well, 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 you must be Ty. G'day. So, you old coot. <laughs> What's this contraption? That's a very good question. Really, just fell <laughs> asleep. This contraption is the key to finding the talisman. Why is this so? It's quite simple, really. It uses an oscillatory microfeeder to scan for trace energy signals that match the unique power matrix of the talisman. Huh? <laughs> like a big nose that sniffs them out. Oh. Ah. Oh. And thunder eggs are the key to powering the Isn't machine. That? Thunder eggs? Oh, they're as rare as hen's teeth, mate. Couldn't you just use batteries? <sighs> if only it was that easy. You see, this machine doesn't just find where the talismans are, it actually teleports them here. What struck me lucky? And that, my friends, requires a great deal of energy. So, uh, how is Ty here gonna find all these thunder eggs? 
Hey, I was just wondering that myself. That's a very, very good question. Reasonable question. I've created these portals to lead Ty to areas rich with them. Of course, they won't just be lying yeah, all over the place. Yeah, that would be too easy. Just their luck. A lot of them will have already been found. The trick will be convincing the locals to part with their prize. Yeah, possessions. but that's... But I, I remember I some of this, but... If you're as resourceful as they say, Ty, I'm sure you'll think of something. Okay. I turned down right, Ty, the game no audio just a tiny bit. About. You've got to find a second boomerang. I'll see you in two up. Okay. Need 17. Oh, we might as well head in. Two up. This billabong has got the lot. Also, sometime this week or next week, we're starting Spyro. I'm going through Spyro. There's plenty to do here, so let's get a move on. Same thing with Crash Bash. We're going to start Crash Bash sometime. Here. your problem I found you a second where is it ring. that's great where is it see that tree over yep. there yeah well it's not <laughs> why did you right well, where is it it's on top of frill neck peak oh great oh don't worry you'll just have to jump run rang and bite your way there while avoiding boss Cass's henchmen look mate life wasn't meant to be easy beauty butler bonza i got one yeah yeah down 71 to go. Jesus. <laughs> Come on, let's get a move on. This is a thunder egg, I'm guessing. Not gonna tell me where you. I reckon those dunnies are a complete waste of space. <laughs> Only last week I used one, walked two blocks, was clobbered by a frill, and then woke up back on the dunny, which was the best place to be given the surprise I got. This Julius reckons it's got something. This is to do basically with the, the checkpoint system. Conundrum. But if you ask me, I think it's a load of bull dust. So you're saying that if I have an accident, I'll end up back at one of these? Something like that. Truth time! You've got a fair set of choppers on you. I reckon you could put them to good use by pressing the bite button. Yeah, I already did that. I jumped and used the bite button and did that uh, that dive into the ground. The first part probably is 30 minutes long. Now, I was speaking to a bloke down the local water and hole, and he reckons you can use your rings to take care of enemies and smash things. You ripper! He said something now, wait a minute, he said something about pressing the throw button to use them. Anything behind the waterfall? Nope. Oh no, not more cage. Struth! What a 
happened here? Boss Cass did this. He's caged all your bilby mates and hidden them across the land. Oh, yeah? Well, big mistake. No one messes with my mates. Now, there's a thunder egg in each area if you free them. Oh. No worries. Unless you're Boss Cass. Why, right? You youngins have it easy these days. If you want to get a better look at your surroundings, okay. just wiggle your camera stick, and you can adjust the camera distance by pressing the okay. camera distance button. In my day, we had to get off our backsides if we wanted to see the world. Just made it a little farther back. Probably eventually find out what those do. For right now, there's two of them. I don't know if it's true, but I heard about this bloke who found 300 opals, then took them to Julius's opal machine. Anyway, something weird happened, and he ended up with a thunder egg. <laughs> right, eh? Okay, so that's what we're collecting opals. I can remember this. So, bite, bite attack over and over. I remember a little bit about this game. Like I said, it's just, it's, it's been so long. Might as well check every time we drop down just in case there is a ledge or something. Wonder how many we'll have to free throughout the level. Like I said, it's been a long time since I've played this game. A long, long time, and it just brings nostalgic back watching this. Those reminds me of those uh, creatures in Banjo and Kazooie. Hmm. Yes. Yes. This just might. Where are they, Professor? Get I, Julius? Oh, hello, Donna. You, you know this golden cog just might be perfect for my latest invention. The cogulaceous boomerangulus extrapolator. Right. What's that? Why, it's a machine that creates experimental techno rangs. I need golden cogs to build a new one. Fifteen. Okay. That. And if you find enough... Bring them to my lab in Rainbow Cliffs, and I'll build you a new boomerang. Okay, well, we have a goal now. On, mate. 
I think 300 is on every level, which would be my guess. For them telling me 300. make that jump. That's probably gonna loop back around type area. back to the other area real quick. <laughs> Let me go back to the other area. I want to look at something real quick. I'm going to see if I can jump from this. No. Okay. I want to try one more last time. Just in case I missed it by a little bit. You can lock your camera on to enemies at any time by pressing and holding the lock on. Right trigger, okay. I was trying to do it with crates and stuff, but it doesn't seem like crates will work. Likely you're supposed to walk around the wall there to jump up to get to that. At least that's my guess. Oh, this game. Blast in the past. Oh. Just how everything is dying in a certain way. Not oh, what is this? Oh yeah, health. Right now, high is the health. There should be achievement. Yeah, that's it. It looks like it came out for Xbox One yesterday. This game. life. Okay, well I have to look out for those two because I know I'm gonna go through lives like nothing eventually. I 
Okay, that's also cool to know. So we can meet, we can run into areas where we'll have our enemy count. We're probably gonna most likely kill everything that we run into. At least if we can kill it, we, we'll try to. Wow, it looks like today wasn't a complete waste of time. Well, we got a second boomerang. You seem to have learned a thing or two. Oh, yeah, you're too right. Ah, you know, there's one other thing I could show you, but uh, I don't know if you're ready for it yet. Yeah? Well, what's that? Well, a mate of mine who knows a mate who knows a mate who knows another mate says you can use two boomerangs to glide long distances. How do I do that? How? It's simple, really. You jump, then press and hold oh, okay. jump in to start gliding. Right. Is that safe? Safe as ours is, mate. See if you can glide across this gap to reach that thunder egg. Ripper! Uh, look at that. Me mate, 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 mate was telling the truth after all. <laughs> Just as well I didn't call for an ambulance. <laughs> We're gonna run back well, because I'm guessing we need the glide to get up there. Colors. And as a little extra bonus, a stopwatch will appear near the start. Okay. What's that for? The race track. You can race the clock to win another Thunder Egg. Right. I'll give that a go later. <laughs> well, that's enough gas bagging from me. Let's head back to the Bly Bly station. Okay, so we have time events, which makes sense. down at the local watering hole last night and this bloke was bragging about how he could throw a boomerang better than anyone else he reckons if you hold down your ties view button you can get a rang's eye view of your target huh. so got me thinking would that really work see these air platforms underneath are three switches why don't you use ties view to target and shoot them you might just find an easier way to get to that thunder. Okay. Thank you. See, I could remember this being in the game. I just couldn't remember how to get that. And a half bad effort, Ty. I reckon with a little more practice, you'll get there. Cool. This probably achievement to beat your first time trial, which we're probably gonna go do. Okay, so five per level. That's good to know.
There's an extra life down there. But we don't know how to swim yet, so that's absolutely useless. I want to try to run through this time trial. So 305 of those guys at a time trial. Looks like we're still missing some stuff here. Plus, I've already gotten them. I don't know. Yeah, because I've already gotten that. What we've gotten... Missing two opals. One for collecting 300, and the other one did the time trial, would be my guess. to the track. Race to the finish as fast as you can, mate. The checkpoints will lead the way. Okay. But miss one and the race is over. <laughs> That's fine. Good luck. It's a ripper of a race, Ty. You're faster than a long-legged eel with a case in the belly. <laughs> uh. A case in the belly. I reckon you've earned this. Oh, you beauty. So if we look at the map now. Yeah, so the only one left was for 300. So when we get there... We can actually skip halfway through because of that. Because of the glide, I could just jump over the water thing. So, we'll be there shortly. Otherwise, after we leave the area, I believe that's where I'm going to call the episode. Episode 1, or part 1, of Tai the Tai is Made in Tiger HD uh, playthrough. Uh, because it seems like then, we have then gotten everything out of this level that we can right now. Um, maybe will there'll be yeah so it looks like there's something else to collect here because we have zero out of seven but I'm guessing we have to come back for that We're 10% done with the game. 
I know this game is actually going to be quicker than I think it is going to be, but that's only because this game was a game back in Xbox era where games weren't that long to begin with. Actually, we'll probably exit the first level and see if they tell us about anything else real quick, and then we'll call it that. We'll call it there for part one. See these funny-looking mushrooms? Yep. If you stand in the middle of them, something weird will happen. The mushrooms here. I'm really hoping there is. Oh, there's right here. Oh, thank God. Thought we were going to have to walk through that entire thing again. I found it. I found it. Let me see that. At last, a mystic talent. It's time. We got four more talismans to find. You there, fetch my man. <laughs> I think these will be given to bosses. Imaginable power will be mine. 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 <laughs> yeah, I think more than likely they will be given to bosses and then we'll have to get them. What's this? Shipwrecks. And walk in the park. If we do anything, more than likely I will probably go back to that water section. Uh, where we found the first two rainbow shells and actually look around a little bit. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, Thunder Eggs power this talisman machine. Make sure you visit all the portals. It's good to see. Okay, uh, so we'll probably go back to that water section down there to look around for a little bit. But otherwise, this is the end of part one. If you guys did like the video, give a like. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel, I recommend subscribing to the channel to keep up a lot of content. Otherwise, I'll probably record at least a part two uh, right after this. Um, and then uh, we'll come back for a part three uh, because I have other stuff to record. I have a lot to record today uh, because next week will be movie week where we'll do seven different movies, reactions, and reviews on the channel. Uh, so, starting from Monday through Sunday. So, I've, I've only recorded one movie reaction. I have six more to do uh, in the meantime. So, we'll be busy. Otherwise, hopefully you did enjoy the video. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel, recommend subscribing to the channel to keep up with all content. But otherwise, when we hit 1,500 subscribers, we'll be doing a gift card giveaway. Uh, Xbox, PlayStation, Nintendo, Steam. Uh, depending on who wins, they get to decide. I go out, buy it, send you the code. Um, otherwise, you have to be subbed for it. Uh, when we hit 1,500, we'll be doing that. We'll be doing two gift card giveaways at 2,000. Um, so, if you guys like the video, give it a like. If you guys haven't subscribed, like I said. Otherwise, we will be continuing this. I'm going to be trying to do this every other day, most likely. 
Uh, same thing with Serious Sam. We're probably going to swap it out. So like last night was Serious Sam. Uh, today will be Ty. And tomorrow will be Serious Sam and then Ty. So we'll probably swap it back and forth like that. So otherwise, hope you guys did enjoy the video. Have a good morning. Have a good afternoon. Have a good night. Wherever you are, just have a good day. Hope I see you guys next video. And peace.